Hey guys, uh, just a little video talking about um, walking the path towards um, supernatural powers, um, cities. Uh, we have to remember that um, everything that we need to, uh, to accomplish our goal of achieving superhuman powers, uh, everything we need is within within ourselves, within our body, within our mind, within, within our heart. Um, and we have to begin to let go of um, external attachments, and not just attachments, but also um, distractions. You know, the world the modern world is, seems always to be trying to distract us, to draw us away from our focused path. And these distractions come in many different forms. We all have our own, you know, personal distractions that we have to realize and eventually overcome we are to make any serious progress you know, on this path. Basically, modern society seems to, seems to be programmed in a way that uh, tries to distract us as much as possible from the, the true path that we know inside that we should be following but because of all these different distractions coming into our life, um, then it makes it just makes the journey uh, that much more difficult. So if we can begin to let go of um, physical physical things in this world and try to block out the various distractions. All we really need is a deep burning passion for that which we wish to achieve and the focused, you know, the very strong focused mental willpower that is going to act as the fuel on our journey to get us where it is that we need to be and we need to strive towards having a, a pure heart, a pure mind and love should be the predominant emotion that that we experience in our, in our daily life. And when I talked about um, the attachments that we have to, to physical things, you know, in a physical world, that doesn't mean to say that you have to throw away all of your possessions. What it means is that you can have things in life you can have money, you can have a beautiful house, you can have everything you, everything you want, but you don't fall into the trap of becoming attached to them. So that if you, if you lose them, you don't feel like you've lost part of yourself. You can just think to yourself, okay, that's gone and you can just continue on your journey without having all of that uh, emotional trauma that comes along with um, losing a possession. This kind of thinking is not something that will suddenly just happen and you'll 
lose all attachment, attachment to your physical possessions. This is more of a journey, a process of learning and it will take time, it will take months, years of, of training yourself to master yourself, master your emotions, attachments to physical objects will only cause you know, emotional pain and turmoil um, if those objects get broken or if you lose them or if they get stolen um, you're going to feel sad and you know that can be avoided those feelings can be avoided if you just don't create those emotional bonds with the object in the first place. An example in my life would be, um, you know, I love crystals. You know, I've got all these um, beautiful crystals and rocks. You know, I, I love to have them around. They make me feel good. Um, I've got loads of them. But if one day I happen to wake up and you know they've all gone, then I'm gonna to think to myself, oh well they've gone, it's happened, and just move on. No emotional pain um, from the loss. I'm not saying that you have to become um, like a robot, you know, totally devoid of all emotion. That's not what I'm saying. You can have the feelings of enjoyment, but you just don't become attached to them, to these objects, so that they don't feel like they're a part of you. You, like I said, you have everything you need and you were born with everything you need. That's all you need in this life. Everything else is just extras. You can enjoy the physical world, physical objects, physical things. You can enjoy the, all the wonderful things that the, the physical world has to offer us. But just be careful that you don't fall into the trap of becoming attached to them and if achieving superhuman powers is your goal then this area which I just talked about is something that you will have to address in your life you know, at some point in order to reach those higher spiritual levels. Okay guys, thanks for watching and I'll see you again soon.